Spirit Halloween, Spirit Halloween. We are at Spirit Halloween in uh, some place in Texas. And here we have the front ISC with Leatherface and Stilton. Oh! That Stilts is a bit deformed in the nose there. He's not looking too good. He's a bit. That nose is really deformed. He's got the heckle syndrome, but it's okay. Stilts is dope. 350 for Stilts. And, uh, I don't know about that. The pins look so good on him. And here we have Leatherface. Oh, his mask is a bit. It's a bit weird but have you seen under the head though? under his mask is a true tragedy and here's another face it's actually cool that his saw spins compared to the lowe's one this is easily better than the lowe's one but i would say lowe's spirits and then party city that would be my initial ranking and he's also he's fat spirit hollow cemetery oh i didn't even notice I don't really notice those gargoyles up there. And then the sensor, if the owl works. Oh, I guess not. But dude, like, these lamp posts are sick as well. This whole archway is such a cool... This is probably my favorite archway they've done since they've ever done an archway. I just really like the aesthetic of it and the tree. I really need to get a tree. These trees are so heavy duty. It seems like a hassle to get through though, but... They're really cool. That's definitely one of the best parts about the theme. And then over here we have the Martian. He's so cool. No water, but if he was only not $400. <sighs> he's so dope, but he's $400, so that's like... What the heck? Just look at him in there. He's one of the best of the year, easily. Oh, now we're going over here to the Widow. She's so cool, I'm glad she came back, or kind of like, from online to in-store, because she really needed to be seen in stores. <laughs> She's one of the best online onlys, to be honest, to be honest. Then we go and see our boy Slim, our $400 Slim animatronic. <laughs> this one doesn't have as bad as a face as I've seen. This one actually has an okay face, but some of the ones I've seen in stores are horrible. And of course, you got the PNG popcorn bag. Look at that. He's also a $400 animatronic. Like, okay. Over here, we have one of the goats. Poor George. Is he on? <laughs> Hello, poor George. What? Gosh, he's already broken? Poor George. Oh, there we go. Easily one of the best of the year, and only 180. That's such a steal. Oh shoot, okay, we're going inside. We're going inside. We have Dagger Mike. We have the gargoyles with the flame lights. These are so sick. These are my favorite parts of the ISC in here, at least. Do they have the projection line? Oh, they have the projection line, actually. The projection's dope. Desmodus, Desmodus! Check! Everything in here looks so cool, and here's Grim's arm. Once again, it's literally Grim's arm from SVI. This is an SVI Grim arm. That's crazy. Then we got candles. They look cool. Then we got flame lights, gargoyle, and scary scene scare. Oh, my God. oh, this one's slow. This one is very slow. I think he is better than the OG. He definitely looks better. Like all of his clothes are washed up. But dang, maybe you should have contacted the Wicked Makers before you did that. Be very scary. And here we have Dagger Mike. He's actually really good now that I see him in person. And he's fast. He is fast. He is actually, he's growing on me so much. I honestly, I might end up with him at the end of the season. Cause he's honestly like really cool. Like I know I said like his pants look so long, but like he's such a simple clown. He's just like a really good clown jump scare. Like he's, he's got his daggers. Like look at that, it actually looks, that actually looks pretty good. Ooh, here we have the entire back ISC. No hell spawn. Here we got Eternal Rest, who is very annoying in store and loud. And she actually is working and not doing a 360 spin. Darling Dolly. One of the best of the year.
Easily one of my favorite techie props for this year. She's just so scary. Like, this is genuinely a terrifying doll prop. You just don't know, like, what she is. It's, it's really terrifying. And you got the amazing sturdy tree for $250. And we have the best of the year, Gordo. Easily. Gordo sweet. He's just one of the greatest ever. He's literally one of the greatest. Just look at his pumpkin seeds. Like, he's just too good. And he stays on, and his jump scares fast. He's just a masterpiece. And his pillar, his pillar literally looks real. What else could you ask? Like, and he's also $150? He's such a great prop. He is such a great prop. He's a bit not, like, it's not really centered right there. Gonna have to return that, but, oh, we got black heart. Oh, why is, what the heck did they do to her? That is not even close. Not even close to where it's supposed to be. What the heck? <laughs> like, she's not even in the hand. She could just literally walk out. That's crazy. Okay, we got Skelly Bones. Skelly Bones. Jeez, how is he that fast? Crazy Crate has the fastest. And then we also have Techie. Desmodus. One of the best of the year, easily, easily. Just this pillar sucks. Like, look, it's vacuum form, and you can, like, see where you have to Velcro it. Like, come on. Slightly low quality, slightly disappointing vacuum form. Also, a great watcher. She actually looks pretty dope here. Although her candle, I think that's... Is that, set, that is definitely set up wrong. That is 100% set up wrong. New version's really good. Oh, here's the door opener. Let's do it. Okay, wow. Wow, that was so crazy. I'm so scared right now. It's it's not even on. It's not even on. Wait, is this supposed to be a brown jumping spider too? Uh, okay. Um, is it is it gonna close? I guess not. It's just open. Oh, there we go. Behind me, we got howling spirit, and we got another tree. I love you, tree. It's gonna go through here. Got the good old gargoyle from 2016. He's really good. Easily an amazing gargoyle, but 300 though, that's a bit sus. And here we have Howling Spirit, which honestly, he's a good filler ghost. He does look kind of cartoony though in the face, but for a filler, like ghost, for someone starting out, like he's honestly pretty good. His clothes are, okay, they're not the worst quality. It's very soft, he's made by SVI, and he's like eight feet. So honestly, and he's also weatherproof. Look at his base, that is, clearly weatherproof so i mean he's not bad you know for only 200. lord raven tombstone honestly lord raven would have been good in this theme he would have looked pretty good we have all the stock there's actually so much stock we got a leather face an emmeline of course she's in store after i buy her i would have got her in store punch you get this out of here got a stilts slim jim four scary sitting scarecrows another emmeline are you serious oh my okay they got poor George and a dagger Mike. They got one howling spirit. Yes, 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 yes. Darling Dolly, darling Dolly. Darling Dolly, darling Dolly. Finally, we have Black Heart, also another crazy crate goat. We have a Grave Watcher and her box is so tiny. We have the Tunnel Rest, two straw mans. All these bubbas, all these doggos. One, two, three, doggos. Another scary sitting scarecrow. And then four regular sitting scarecrows. Two fogging skull piles. A bunch of posen stay skeletons. And a, a Betty Sharp, ew, what the heck? No wonder she didn't sell. She's overstocked because she's so bad. No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry, Betty Sharp girl. Please forgive me. We got a, there's a Betty Sharp and there's a widow. We have stuffed dummies. 1,000 jumping spiders. Oh snap, they got a bunch of the zombie babies, oh my gosh. They have... <laughs> Gusty Gwyn. She's one of the best zombie babies in recent. Like, honestly, we need more animated zombies back. Bring them all back. Flashback animated zombie babies, bro. Bring them all back. This one, she's really cool. She's really cool. Got Snacking Stevie. Mothy Max. 
And then... There we go. Like the shrub or any of them on? <laughs> you cannot hear anything in the store, but the shrub all the way from 2013. We got Billy. Then we got I forgot her name. And then we got Chomp and Connie. She's very cool. Oh shoot! Oh oh okay. We got George, poor George right here. We got the zombie baby cradle, which is honestly dope for zombie baby collectors. It's honestly really cool to have. And then Ghostface, Sam, Leatherface, Pennywise. He looks scary. We have the ornaments. The Mars Attacks one is actually so cool. Mars Attacks Ornament is dope. We got Michael Myers, Pennywise, Leatherface, Sam, all the projections. Oh, they have the Chucky Sidestepper. I've not seen the Chucky Sidestepper, so let's it's do them. Showtime. <laughs> and then we got Billy, Ghostface, Sidestepper. That one. These are not working well at all. Well, they're all broken, and we got Sam! Sam. And here we have all the dolls. We got Annabelle and Sam. Once again, she looked like she farted. Then here we got Chucky. First thing we gotta do is get out of this body once and for Chucky Greeter. And all the NBC Nightmare Before Christmas. Yo, I actually want this Oogie Boogie plush. I actually, oh. It's a pretty cool plush. They really got always some cool NBC merch, and they got Jack too. Cool Jack, Sally, this frame. Christmas comes to Halloween Town. This is Halloween. These are all so cool. We even got another Oogie Boogie. And here we have Hocus Pocus, which I don't really care for, but Billy Butcherson head. Tombstone, that's pretty cool actually. More Hocus Pocus. All the Beetlejuice, we got the tombstones, the Beetlejuice sign, this is actually dope. And all these plushes. And, oh, there's that random door knocker, the... What do you want? You don't have an appointment, do you? Miss Argentina. You all these pillows, plushes, oh, they had this, too, from last year. Oh, they got the Lydia sidestepper. Nice. Nice merch, and then we got that tombstone. Amazing. And the same one plush. That's actually cool. We have all the Haunted Mansion merch here. Got the mask, Ezra mask, Phineas mask. These are so cool. The bat. And ooh, that. It's a really cool magazine frame. This fleece of the Haunted Mansion portraits are dope. Look at that pillow. Haunted Mansion sign. Haunted Mansion towel. A decor panel that lights up. Look at all these uh, plates. They might have to get that Haunted Mansion plate. And then we got the bust. This one. They look really good. And then here we have the door knocker. Should be moving, but. And here we have the good old Fred. Tombstone, pretty cool. It's kind of tiny, but it's tiny. Same with the Madame Leota one. It's pretty tiny. And then we have the that tomb, sweet tomb. Ooh, look at this lantern of all the portraits too. That's so cool. And then more haunted mansion. We have this wreath. That's a pretty cool wreath that lights up, or it doesn't light up because it's broken. And then here we have. All these portraits. This hatbox ghost with the crown. Look at that. Madame Leota. Just like, flick it. There we go. This little... I don't even know... Wait, what is this? This cool. We got the gargoyles. That's dope. I'm gonna... A glass set. 
All the Haunted Mansion merch is so cool this year. And here we have all the other decor. We got MT Soul Girl on a swing. Forgot she even existed. Then we have Sinister Spirit Doll also. Forgot that existed. The Witch, which is new. Or was that last year? I don't remember. She's okay. Crimson Girl on a swing. Decrepit Haunted Doll. If she works. If she doesn't work. Okay. Emma. Doesn't work either. Loving Lilf. Doesn't work. That demonic dolly. Who doesn't work? Monkey Chimes. I actually might get him. I wish they brought back the old one though. I really would like the old one to come back as well. Oh, here we go. Oh. Monkey Chimes. We got the butcher. Okay, none of these. There we go. He's dope. Got the hand mechanisms and grabbers. This pumpkin skull is actually sick. That's actually really cool. How much is this? 20 bucks? I mean, it's kind of tiny, but it's actually really cool. Got the skull stack, definitely not from Home Depot. The pumpkin stack, definitely not from Home Depot. We got this three-foot hanging tattered girl. And then we have faceless specter. And we have the witch, hanging witch. She actually looks pretty cool. Oh, then we have the clown. Sunstar. He's not working. Oh, we got this guy too. Also Sunstar. Sam. Oh, there's the pumpkin one. None of these work. Why are none of them working? And we got this guy. Does he work? Doesn't work either. Then we have the scary flying ghost. I'm pretty sure someone did unboxing on this recently. I think it was Hollow Weird and Green Science Boy. They did an unboxing on this. Pretty cool. And oh my gosh! The best animatronic. Ghost wing. They have three ghost wings. Three ghost swings. I repeat, everyone run to the store now. Then we have our gore. We have the head with the thing, majing, and then we have the heads all together. This hanger, another zombie hanger. Got the ham hog neck chain. Got the severed gore over here. Decaying zombie groundbreaker. What is even is that? Got ooh, cat. Got this good old bunny rabbit, and then we got the dog. All these. Spiders, dropping spider, zombie lawn stakes, sound effects box, voice changer, DC adapter, make sure you plug that in, multi-prop remote, skull stick set, where we got the candelabras, 55 inch candelabar, these are actually dope, these are actually pretty cool, might get those eventually, dog machines, all these skeletons, this pumpkin one's actually pretty cool, that's a pretty cool pumpkin one, and this looks so funny, this is the best one right here, easily my favorite one, like, I can't even describe that. This is actually cool too. All the dog machines. Oh shoot, they actually have the Fright in the Box inflatable. The Fright in the Box inflatable, which is surprisingly big. It's eight feet, which is kind of crazy. A lot bigger than the original one. We got the Jacqueline and Archway. Purse. Sitting Scarecrow, not scary. Cat. Haunted Tree. Jacqueline and Wolf. Reaper. Ghost. Gargoyle. Whatever that is. 